Our reactions to all 24 episodes of Parasite are on our Patreon and in full length. You can get access to them right now by pledging $1 to our Patreon. Link in the description. Welcome, Welcome back, back to the Cruise Brothers, Brothers React. React. Back from our Parasite and uh, the first of two episodes have just been weird after weird. It's crispy. Been, it's been very crispy. Crispy. Um, I don't know if that's the word. Yeah, that's the word. <laughs> Stop doing this with your hand. Anyway, anyway guys, uh, this parasite shit just keeps getting interesting. I'm, I'm interesting. I'm interested to see more of the other aliens. So how about we get straight into this because we did get like some teaser on one of them last. Bro, episode. one of them tried to convince this thing. What was it, Maggie? Some shit. Whatever his name was, the hand thing, to come into his body. Yeah, but, but I wasn't he, talking about that, that alien. Guy. Yeah, but that, that guy's Dunsky. That guy's over with. We ain't seen him again. I'm talking about the guy that. Whoa. We saw at the end, which, by the way, I want to talk a little bit about that. Um, Whoa, the fact, the, the guy at the end who um, pretty much saved that girl, like it's it's weird because that guy, I can't tell if he's a bad guy or a good guy, you know, because he he ends up saving a girl from a group of thugs. The group of thugs come back, hit him in the head with a bat. He kills them, and then he's like, "Oh, I gotta change my face." That's the guy I'm talking about because that's the one that looks like he's the real deal. And I'm pretty sure they've shown him in the first episode as well too. But let's get into oh, it and right, see yeah. what's going on. That happened. That like was like the, random. The, it was like a random after thing. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm fucking touching people. I'm a Lester. What the fuck? <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Where's your proof? Not <laughs> weird. Damn. Girl ain't normal, bro. That she's one of them. Look at her, bro. She don't even look normal as a human. <laughs> she can't even. She can't even be on the cover. That's how fucking weird she looks. <laughs> Yo, seriously, that guy in the in the in the beginning, right? Looks nothing like him, bro. You know the one they show in the intro with the hand, the slick back hair. He looks nothing like him. If that's him, he turns into a badass. Yeah, he just has his hair different. No glasses. He won't keep goes from being a nerd to a cool ass guy. Yeah, why is he talking to him now? Migi, that's what his name is. Yeah, he named it already, remember? Yeah, no, it's him. Not. I said Maggie earlier. Already? Again? Here we go. Not when he has his girlfriend with him. Someone in the school? Yo. Someone in the school? I mean, where else could they be going? It looks like a big building. Yeah, it's in here, bro. Yeah, it's one of the kids, bro. One of his classmates. Or maybe it's a teacher. You can look around for days. You ain't gonna find him. It could be a oh. teacher, though. 30 meters. Yo, it could be anybody, bro. <coughs> Pretty sure he senses them, too. A girl? Oh, it's her, the one in the bus. Yeah, it's oh, her. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's her. Is that his class? Oh, that's her class. In his class. Oh no, you made eye contact. <laughs> She found them, bro. Damn, on the cover, yeah. yeah he's, she is very. You think about that, bro. And for her to do that, she has to know mad about the humans already, bro. So exactly, that means she's yeah. mad of all the past this guy. It's pretty crazy. It's cool, man. It's cool. There's like more intelligent, like aliens who are like really it's, it's, fitting it's into pretty society. much kind of like yeah it's kind of like how i pictured it in the first episode how it's gonna be they're gonna have higher ups and like the governments like there's a teacher here what do you mean oh you mean they're just you think just aliens in the government just planning themselves in society as important people is what i meant yeah <laughs> She even knows. She even knows yeah. the location. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. 
There's nothing yeah, music, bro. There's nothing either of them will gain out of fighting here. <laughs> she hasn't met somebody she just wants who, who, had, who made a failure. Exchange information. Damn. That's a common interest these aliens can have exchanging information instead of just killing each other. But what happens after that? This man trying to spit game? <laughs> Look at his face. Man happy. Two people coming. <laughs> Two of my kind? Yo. She's got someone else on her squad. So we don't know that yet. Yo, she's got really got someone else on her squad? Who is it? Man, I'm nervous. He's like, you're making me anxious. <laughs> he said, <laughs> he's like, slow your heartbeat down. Like, he could do it. <laughs> Yo, this guy looks mad obvious. <laughs> Bro, don't do that in public. He, they literally felt each, each other's killer intent immediately. That's why they both freaking went like that. Yeah. Yo, this is Yo, the reproducing a normal human being? No. Oh, okay, so nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. So they can... Hmm. So they're they're parasites, bro. The other humans in order to do that. That's like cannibalism. This guy's getting mad. <laughs> Three seconds. Yo, he's, he's basically saying, he's I got them here. hostage. Bro, listen, bro. If you do anything to freaking step out of line or challenge me, I'll kill the whole class. Word. And he has more to lose if he tries to kill her. Exactly. Because he can't change his face. Oh, it's him. Oh, sh Yo, this guy is insane. He just Kids busted in. Bro. Yo, this girl trusted the wrong, or this alien trusted the wrong yeah, person. Who was that guy anyway? Why did she bring him there? We didn't get nothing from him at all. We don't know who the hell he is at all. Well, she did say she likes exchanging information and stuff like that. Yeah, so but like, who? Might have been somebody she was exchanging. Oh, no, they had sex too, remember? Yeah, right. But, you know, just for an experiment, though. That's it. <laughs> Oh my god, yo. Shit, yo. These things are just out in the open. Like, how does no one know about them yet? Do people know just about neutralized them? three obstacles. <laughs> she called them obstacles, bro. Or the... It called them obstacles. Intense. Bro, you're just gonna let all these kids die? Bro, he gotta get out of there, bro. What? He's gonna use these people as bait? Look at what he's saying, bro. He's gonna sacrifice people's lives. It's simplistic, but it has a high probability of success. Yo, Yo he's, there's no way he's gonna go with that. You gotta think of your own plan. A wall of meat, you could say. Yo, that is crazy, bro. He's using them as a wall of me, bro. Look, this thing has no. He's like, I forgot where you are. Look, he ain't gonna, he ain't gonna do that though. He's getting away from everybody. Damn, bro. He has to get serious, bro. Yeah, with the animation. Yo, look, they oh, both about to fight. They both about to fight, yeah. Two against one. A and I are just. He has to, he has to give them an edge. 
Yo, they're gonna have to train together, bro. Yo, Yo this is gonna be high. These guys are gonna learn how to use this thing and actually learn how to fight. Yo, here we go. This is your. This is the time for you to show what you're capable. Of. Directly below. Oh shit! Oh my god! That's scary, bro. He's literally just looking at them from below. <laughs> oh my god. This guy is seriously cannot escape. <laughs> he made freaking dumbass shit there just to freaking block himself in. Word. Damn, it ended like that. I wanted to see the fight. Yo, that fight is, sounded like it was gonna be this cool. This is good, bro. I love this pacing right now, bro. It's perfect. Yeah. Like the pacing is really good. So I like that. I like how they have to work together, kind of. I like that he has to do something finally because it felt like he hasn't been doing shit. Yeah, like it, <laughs> it, it makes me, it makes me, um, like think that he, there's room for him to grow and improve with this new alien thing that's with him like is he gonna get nice too you know is he gonna like actually yeah. train this alien has fight? some powers he has some cheating powers but uh at the same time i think uh migi is at a disadvantage as well just because he's not as full-fledged as some of these other aliens um especially that girl the teacher one she seems like she's no joke and she's just like slowly learning but she that's a smart alien right there bro and that's a day if, if you have a smart alien it's a dangerous alien as well it could be a double-edged sword bro yeah it, it's cool to see how smart migi is mm -hmm. and it, it it's cool to see that um these aliens not only they they might be like um other aliens who don't have any regard for human life or, or or anything like that really don't show too much emotion but what they do have is uh distinct personalities in my opinion um because we see Migi, he's like, he's kind of like a smart one, alien, right, that likes to do research. We saw um, the dog or whatever. Also, we found out that these aliens apparently are human for, are not human, but um, the, they say that the alien that is like, was like kind of an animal on their, in their planet or something, it takes over the animals and then the other ones take, pretty much they eat what they are kind of thing, kind of thing. So that that one that ate the dog was the reason he ate the dog is because he was a dog or something like that i'm sorry i don't know if i'm making sense but i'm pretty sure that's what they said but um i don't remember that um but it's just interesting to see migi because he you could tell that he has his own personality and so does um the teacher tamaya i think her name was i forgot her name um it seems that she is very smart as well and then we see this guy over here which his personality more is more of like a rash type uh like do shit without thinking about it you know well like, when you can change your face they can get away with a lot i know like but it's like it's like he had you can tell that he has uh, he doesn't care about his human face the human face that he's wearing right now you could tell that tamaya cares about the, the human face she's wearing because she has um blended into society with this body and she has a role with this body so it's not something that she just wants to give up you know yeah um, that's true she can change her face at any time so i wonder why exactly the reason she doesn't and that's just, what i because what i just said of her um of her position and what she's probably all the work she's putting on that body you know she i'm telling you, she's smart but she knows what she's doing and she's not gonna put herself in jeopardy to freaking stop this okay, guy but what what does that her position do for her like the i'm not sure to be honest but i feel like it has it has perks or something that she, i like, get what you're think saying about it, i get think what about you're it. being though. a teacher that's all the knowledge that you can have of everything. That's probably why she's so True. knowledgeable because she's in that role as a teacher. So that's that might be a reason why she picked that role. But um, who knows yeah, what other roles there is? I, I could definitely see the president's an alien. I, I could see it. I definitely could see different scenarios where, like, there's aliens in the government type shit. That's like you're conspiracizing. That's what I'm saying. Um, like, I, I predicted that in episode one, so I'm pretty sure if that happens, like, you know, I called it. But I can see it happening very interesting but with stuff. her case it's not exactly clear but yeah the teacher thing learning stuff that might be the reason yeah it's it's very interesting and we and uh, and we continue to get this dyma dynamic with migi and um, um izumi or zuki whatever his name is I forgot his name already um i think it's the zumi kan i forgot what the fuck his name is but the dynamic between them is so interesting because then you got we got migi on one hand who um is literally an alien life form who doesn't care about humans at all and then 
um, we got Azumi's side of his human side, pretty much, you know, keeping him in check and not letting him kill freaking humans as he pleases, you know, because it's like they said, they really are two entities, two different beings. And that is their that is their advantage against this guy, because there's two of them and one of him. It's crazy. It's interesting. As he said, uh, there's designated roles. I don't know what he meant by that. Is it, did he say designated roles? Something like that. What do you mean? Uh, for when they're both fighting. Yeah, he said. He said, "Well, I'll d I'll d designate roles, which is you know simple enough. He'll probably be a distraction. Then this Zumi will come out of nowhere with the final blow to his head. He'll be like, yo, you have to hit him here to kill him. Like, come on, that's how it's gonna go. But good ass shit. Yep, I like the episode. It was some good stuff, guys. Again, Parasite. It's looking up there. Uh, if you want to see these reactions earlier than the YouTube, you could do so by pledging a dollar." To our Patreon, all the Patreon reactions are in full length as well for a dollar. Make sure to hit the thumbs up button, subscribe if you're new here, and we'll see you in the next one. Follow us on TechCruise. I mean, follow us on twitch.tv slash TechCruise. Link in the description. Um, we play some video games. We play. We do a bunch of other stuff. We do IRL streams sometimes as well. But um, yeah, we're branching out. So go follow us there. Some good stuff over there. We got a good community. Um, but yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves as always and peace. peace.